You're watching KRBC, Abilene's local news at 6. It is now time for our weekly Do My Job segment. You know, that's where every Thursday we kick Scott Cook out of the newsroom. We kick him out of the Weather Center. Yep. And we say, hey, go try someone else's job. And this week he's <laughs> racking up some experience in a pool hall. Even though he has a billiards itch, he's trying to scratch. Or he's trying not to scratch. One of my favorite pastimes is to get out and play some pool. I would usually play with my family, and while they were pretty good, I, however, was not. Even with my lack of skill, I enjoyed playing, and when I learned Abilene had a pool league, I lined up my shot to see if they could break me into the sport. Well, in this particular league, this is for the people who really have never played pool before. Each team has usually a really good player on it, and they're allowed to coach and teach. One of Daryl's tasks as league operator is to determine the player's skill level, and the best way to do that... By playing another player that's in the league. But before we square off, I need to learn some of the basics. It's As a beginner, they showed me how to hold the cue with a closed bridge. And depending on where you hit the ball, it'll either roll forward or come back. Every cue has a feel, and it's not the same feel. One will just kind of call your name. To play better, you need to play with the same exact cue every time you play. Now that I have a better understanding of what I'm doing, it's time to pick what type of pool we're going to play. Nine ball is more points based, where eight ball is more game based. Most of your lower skill level players like nine ball better because they don't have to make the nine ball to win. With at least a dozen minutes of tutorials under my belt, I decided to put my new skills to the test and play a round of eight ball. Although I won the chance to break, there you go. Not bad for a first break. I was no match for my opponent. And as he sunk the eight ball, it was clear that there was still a lot more that I had to learn. And it won't be long until they teach you enough to where you're just as good as they are. You know, it's a lot of fun. If it's something that, that you're interested in, de I definitely recommend coming out and doing it. You meet a lot of really great people, have a lot of fun. It's a really great time. Doing your job around the big country, I'm meteorologist Scott Cook, KRBC News. Good job, Scott, and thank you. And if you would like Scott to try out your job, you can email him at scook at krbc.tv. We'll have sports and more weather coming up after the break. Up next on your local news at 6. Stay with us. Look at sports, forecasts, a new flood warning I just said that. for Brown County. That just issue. I'll talk about it.